while ago, I posted a video showing some ways on how to decorate your phone cases, and you can check that out right here. Since then, a lot of you have asked to see something floral. So in this video, I want to show you some quick and easy ways you can decorate with a floral design using nail polish. These can also be applied to a tablet case or anything else you choose to decorate. And if you want to seal and protect your final design, I recommend using a clear spray varnish on them after you're done. If you try this out on your own case, I would love to see your pictures, so be sure to share those on my social links, and don't forget to hashtag SeaLemon. And as usual, you can find all of these links and more information in the video description below. For this pink one, I'm going to start with some really simple flowers, and the nail polish brush really lends itself to this shape. Just start on the edge of the petal and work your way in. Don't overthink it, these flowers are supposed to look kind of rough and painterly. I like that style, but of course you can make it in any way you want, as perfect as you want, just have fun with it. After those petals are dry, then I'm going to add another color in the center, and some other little flowers here and there. This case has a line right here, so I'm going to work that into a design and make some horizontal lines. Again, I'm totally fine with these looking painterly, and then I'm going to continue the lines on the edge. And here is what that final case looks like. That was such a quick and simple design to make, and I think it turned out pretty good. Nail polish brushes are really good with making dots, so this next one you can try is just a floral pattern with dots. If you have the time to try this out, I recommend it. It's actually pretty relaxing. Using the different colors I have, I'm just going for it and making a simple floral layout. You can try some different colors on top of the first colors you added just to give the flowers a little more dimension. And filling the surrounding space with brown, white, and green for the leaves. The final case turned out to be a mosaic looking floral design. It also has this really cool pebble texture. This next one is super simple to make. This also has a painterly look, and just without thinking too much, I'm just making some really quick rose petals. I really like the sparse look, leaving the white in between, and then I'm just going to make some really simple stems. Brush on some leaves here and there, add some accent color on top of that, adding blue and some pink on the ends of the petals, and then some teal accent around the leaves. I really like the white space around this and how simple the floral is. It was the easiest and quickest to make and I think I like this one the most. I hope you try these out on your own cases and if you do, I would love to see pictures of them, so don't forget to share those on my social links. For more DIY, be sure to subscribe to my channel, Sea Lemon. For more ideas on patterns and things you can draw on your case, check out this playlist right here. There are a lot of videos in there and you can add any of those to your case. Check out another nail polish DIY right here. You can also add that method to your case as well. Let me know which floral case was your favorite in this video, and I will see you guys next time.